Hello, what's happening? Hey, there we are. What's up, Tater, Timefire5, Goofling, uh, Delbach, Tomoes, uh, R. Anubis, Sakasil, Esquire, Mike Bolzari, DSR. Hope we're all having a wonderful day today. I'm actually quite excited to get into uh, some Isaac tonight. Hold on here. Find my stuff. Oh my god, my orientation's all messed up. Oh, that's right. What's up, Skrell, Spartan, Nuke Wave, Dormouse, Pinball Wiz, Happy Belated Birthday, Sir, Mombe, Voldar14, Mr. Decaf, Tig Newtons. Nice, Mike. We got there. We got lucky, but we got there. That's what counts, right? That's what counts. There we go. So, Spicy Pickles, De Guava. 40 minutes into your Mystery Basket VOD now, and the suspense is killing me. Nice to go out. I had a lot of fun doing that uh, this weekend. It was good. What's up, Ariali, uh, Taco Bowl, Shadow Kid 017. Thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the 37 consecutive months, sir. Much love. Delbach, thank you for the 10 consecutive months. And DJ Teddy 1337, thank you for the three months, sir. It's beautiful. Loose Minded, thank you for keeping it down for five months. And Tater, thank you for keeping it down for the past 15. Hot diggity dog. Um, Shadow Kid, would you like to be in the Subscriber Hall of Fame below the broadcast? Your past year, 36 months. Dear God, uh, Time Fire, Kaliskanov, and He Who Watches, thank you all for keeping it dapper. I appreciate you guys' continued support. What's up, Adam Mosk? Loose Minded, R2D2? Today is going to be a good day. But we lost we lost one, so we're at a one streak right now. We didn't drop the streak. We lost it and started a new one. Yes, Shadow Kid. Be happy to add you. Let me do that right now. Whoa there. Did I lose it? Shadow Kid 017 into the Hall of Fame, baby. Done and done. Alrighty, let's hop on over and let me orientate myself here. Very good. Uh, OBS, you're where? There you are. Alrighty, let's hop on in. That's Bambo Jambo. Good to see you, man. Okay, we were on a two win streak. We are on a two win streak. Let's uh, update the title. It is two. That's correct. Because we won the last one last night. How is the uh, gain to voice volume at this current juncture? Okay, we got pad, decent fire rate. Um, yeah, that's okay, I guess. Two soul hearts isn't great, but what can you do? Okay, Cricket's body's uh, definitely nice. Splash damage and tears is good. Volume is spot on. Excellent. I just realized I gotta switch this up real quick. Hold on. I done goofed. Try a different window orientation today, and uh, it's not happening. I'm too set in my ways to break them. We'll leave that as the other monitor, though. Got good. Good ish. Yeah, strong start indeed. It's definitely a good one. Alright, looks appropriate. Well, I'm sure it doesn't look appropriate on the screen, but it'll look appropriate in just a second. It will refresh the window. Okay. 
Doo -doo 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 -doo. All right, thanks for your patience. What's up, Yarmor Four Farm? Nice to see you. All right, so I got away from doing something which I like to do, which is playing uh, a lot more methodical, and I've really gotten uh, into playing uh, kind of hard and fast uh, Isaac, so I want to tone it back a little bit and get back to doing uh, what I know is my best opportunity to play well, which is to slow down and think about stuff and do stuff like actually check the uh, you know locations of secret rooms and stuff like that, which I've just kind of been, well skipping over. What's up, Slappy the Ninja? Nice to see you, sir. Mr. Bob 82 thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the six consecutive months, sir. Oh, cheese and rice. Not doing stuff like that. Ankle Spankin, thank you for keeping it dapper as well. Appreciate the 11 consecutive months. Three-month-old baby boy. Okay, we got there. Do 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 do. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I did not miss Mr. Bob, but thank you. It's Calidus. Thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the nine consecutive months. Much love. Isn't it crazy how fast time flies, Mr. Bob? What a wild and crazy ride. Well, we got six coins, so I think we're gonna we're gonna check out the store here to see if we can get. Yeah, okay. Let's let's, uh, let's see this. If I bomb these rocks right here, I can get the champion belt plus plus soul hearts. What's up, my dad, Martin? Good to see you, man. Okay, that'll work. We also have Chariot Card if we have a, uh, a bad boss, which I doubt we will. Sin Victor, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the 21 consecutive months, sir. Much love. But well, we won't need to use, um... Yeah, we won't need to use uh, the Chariot Card here. Well, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to bomb that Dark Rock, but I think it's still worth it. We got the coin and some damage off out of uh, doing it the way we did. So I think it's going to be worth it for sure. No chance at the secret room here, so we have no bombs, and that's fine. Mr. Pop82, thank you for getting down for the past seven months, sir. Double trouble, my man. I'm a chalk. Little hand to you, friend. Welcome to the dapper I'm a chalk. Appreciate it. Okay, well, since we have uh, three and a half soul hearts now, I am going to take the risk of going up to the, uh, the cursed room here. You never know. Could be an item. You hope it's an item, but it's spiders. I could chariot card out to save a half heart, but I have a feeling this chariot card is going to come in useful on the next boss. Especially if we get some shenanigans like the haunt. We shall see. I'm going to make sure here. Yeah, the bomb's five cents. Fair enough. Months are flying by like seconds. Yeah, Mr. Bob, you got it, man. You got it. Okay, so I was gonna do like an announcement video, but I got sick this week and I'm still, I'm still sick. But that's fine. That's neither here nor there. Uh, I'll just give you guys the long and short of the uh, announcement. I'm gonna be trying to stream more hours Monday through Friday. I'm gonna really try to push for um, eight hours a day, going 7 p.m. to 3 a.m. And whatever that takes to fill that time, we'll make it work. But that was. That was the gist of it. And of course I quit nicotine last week, which was... It's been interesting, but good. What is the gist of Overwatch, um, Sinvicta? What is, what is it the game about? People are kind of hyped for it, but I really don't know what it's... What is it? Impending Doom, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the 19 consecutive months, sir. Much love. Not that one storm. Do 
You're a bad man, Fly. You're a bad man. Tactical squad mate FPS with different heroes and classes, much like Team Fortress. That makes sense. Rainy day in Vegas sounds nice. I'm sure Vegas could use some rain. Okay, so we have a dark rock up here, but I'm, I don't really want to blow it just yet. Hotchkiss, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the 11 consecutive months. Well, long story short, uh, the, the reason I decided to make the change is going to come with some other changes as well, but... Um, been a really, really busy, uh, well, year and a half, you know, got got all sorts of life stuff going on. Everything's finally calmed down so I can start focusing on the actual live broadcast even more. Never lost sight of it, but there was much, definitely less uh, time in the day. So we're going to cut a couple off-stream things and really focus on the live broadcast, because that's what I want to do, is put in more hours. Do 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 How many hours did you average during the Cheer Livestream Challenge? We averaged about seven hours a night, uh, seven days a week. Yeah, Adamos, way to be on that turbo. Turbo's freaking great. Thank you for supporting the site and the streamers that you watch. Enjoy your perks, sir. Hmm, it's a very large floor. It's got kind of got that haunt feel to it, doesn't it? Okay, we're gonna hop over the corner here, get them out, out of there. I can certainly use some range here, but the damage is adequate for caves. Turbo is great, yes. Libra, eh? I think I could definitely afford to take Libra. I haven't had Libra uh, do me wrong uh, ever since I've been taking it. A lot of people really hate it, but uh, I don't. There we go, we got range out of that. I'm sure uh, my damage just went down, but I can afford to take pills now. Bradley Freeze, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the 13 consecutive months, and... Isarune, thank you for keeping it dapper for the past 17 months. The main benefit of Libra is I look at it like, um... I look at it like uh, it gives me a PhD in a way because uh, stat downs don't count as a full stat down, but stat ups count for a bit more. Uh, what Libra does is kind of balances your stat out, so you uh, any stat ups you get kind of just get distributed throughout your build. Dark Rock in the secret room, bottom left. A good freaking eye, sir. Uh, Twitch.tv Turbo gives your the broadcasters you watch a 100% uh, ad fill ratio. Uh, you will never see an ad on the site after uh, getting Turbo, uh, well, as long as your subscription is active, as well as um, gives you custom name colors and some emotes and stuff. But it's uh, pretty pretty great for the broadcasters you watch. Yes, it is Cricket's body. You want to take this and buy this pill. Hey, luck up. Uh, I don't think luck's actually accounted into Libra, unfortunately. That's okay, though. Hey, pills are plenty. Bombs are key. Neat. You can see forever can come with me to the next uh, floor. Yeah, let's fight the boss and then do the cursed room. It's uh, cumulative for the entire run, uh, ankle spanking, so any stat ups you get kind of just get um, swapped throughout.
Riddler Finn, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the five consecutive months, sir. Much, much love. Oh, yeah, I should have taken the chariot into the boss. That's true. We'll use the chariot card to, um... Yeah, I don't want to buy that for three so hearts. I don't have that many uh, hearts. Do, 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 do. Yeah, you know, the damage is not too bad right now. Uh, we saw it on pin. It was actually pretty, pretty adequate. All spiders mo better. I don't think my damage went down at all, anyways. Shining Craig Force, thank you for keeping a damper. Appreciate these 17 consecutive months, sir. Much love. Okay, well... Take the I can see forever pill to the next floor. It's like those guaranteed secret rooms, which is great. Uh, buying hive mind here is tempting, but um, eh, I think we can do better with our coins right now. All right, going down into the caves. We'll definitely need to get a few stat ups to make this Libra pay off, but uh, we could. We got time. All right, we're gonna go right first. Oh, I mean, I already turned down a guppy item, so hive mind seems like an odd purchase. Cheese and rice. Doo -doo. More pills, eh? Tears down. That's a bummer, man. I need some I need some up pills here. Speed up. Okay, speed up's a good pill to know. Yeah, you blue smiley. Happy to be here, sir. Poppity pop 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 pop. Yeah, we're really, really going to try to slow down our Isaac play quite a bit. Uh, I feel like I've been playing way too fast, and it's definitely affecting my play. Not like I'm playing bad or anything, but um, I want to focus on getting better at the game, which is going to take some time. Practice. Okay, I was trying to... That'll do. Also going to try to blow up as many mushrooms as possible, not just for the statistical mushrooms, but I also have the speed up uh, mushroom in the pool, or speed up uh, pill in the pool. So the more of those we can get with Libra, the better off we're going to be. That's so far my only uh, stat up pill, which is kind of, kind of crappy, but that's okay. Speed down, oh goodness. My goodness, this is so bad. Well, blank card's awfully tempting. Okay, we know what one good pill looks like, but it appears there's only one good pill in my pool, which is gonna make uh, my damage probably not be so great uh, later in this run. Anything's possible, though. Oh, cheese and rice, did it to myself. Did that to yourself, sir. No, blank card does not work with pills, uh, for any reason. To my knowledge. Whoa there, buddy boy. Um, okay. Oh, 
four cell hearts, they said. Four. Hello, Envy. Got a good build for you. Or decent enough, anyways. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Splash damage is a good build for Envy. Good enough, anyways. What's up, near nostalgic? Good to see you, dude. I think I'm gonna go for, um, well, I'm gonna try to blow up the mushrooms on the far side over by the super secret room. Right play. Any chance I have to get those speed up pills, I should take. I also have a gambling machine on this floor, though I'd kind of like to save that for uh, the next floor. Or save my money for the next floor. We shall see. All right, let's check, check in here. Uh, okay, I mean... <laughs> I'm going to take the blank card. Uh, preemptively, I'm going to buy this. And then we're going to bomb out to be five coins so we can maybe get an arcade. Maybe. Blow this up, too, real quick. Okay. Now, we don't have a card yet. However, when we do get the card that we want, uh, we'll be in a good spot. We got, oh my goodness, okay, enough. We got uh, mushrooms over here. You know, I'm gonna hold on to my bombs. I'm only getting two two mushrooms per bomb in that room. I wanna get at least three, if not four mushrooms per bomb, or we will run out eventually. Alrighty. OnStar21, thank you for keeping a damper. Appreciate these three consecutive months. Much appreciated. The pleasure meeting you at TwitchCon. I already saw my super secret room uh, today. Or I took I could see forever pill at the start of this floor. God room, you don't say. Okay. Five coins is a prerequisite to an arcade, to my knowledge. Yes. You know what? Yeah, I do want red hearts right now. Thanks. Thanks. All right, going down. Hope you're doing well as well, Mr. Mobius. Do, 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 do. Uh, all right, here we go. Oh my goodness. Panda guns, little hand to you, friend. Welcome to the Dapper Panda guns. Appreciate the support. And Newbert, little hand to you, friend. Welcome back to the Dapper, Newbert. Appreciate the continued support, man. Much love, dude. Double the damper. Sweet, they just gave me a free uh, secret room. That's nice. Continuing, smug sub. Cool, dangerous stain. So far, so good, Lord Jesus. This is the first run of the night, and oh, come on, really? I mean, that might not be bad, but uh, not good. I'll think about it. It is technically a tears up, I guess. Now we can get three mushrooms here. Let's do it. Okay.
I sub just so I can use the lurky mode. Well, that's just fine by me, uh, Pandy Guns. I appreciate having you. Well, what's in here? Three chest. Ah, ah, ah. Tears down, no thanks. PhD would make this run pretty spectacular. Lots of stat down pills. Which I risk because we have Libra. That's cool. Oh, cheese and rice. Rice and cheese. I was hoping there'd be like a key or a card in here. One good card changes my life because of this blank card. Okay, let's go fight our boss and see what happens. Zorian, thank you for keeping a dapper. Appreciate the 18 consecutive months. Ichabod1, thank you for keeping a dapper. Appreciate the 11 consecutive months. Well, very good, Newbert. Well, we're glad to have you back. Boogaloo, thank you for keeping a dapper. Appreciate the one year support. And Acarius, thank you for keeping a dapper. Appreciate the 15 consecutive months. I think you're all lovely and awesome. Thanks for supporting the channel. Legendary players. Holy crap, did you see that spider? Almost hit me in the face, man. Holy guacamole, that's a lot of resubs. Fire balloons, thank you for keeping it damp. I appreciate the five consecutive months. Much love. Much love. What's in here? Spiders. It's all spiders. Cool. It's okay, the, the item was actually a good one for Libra, because we technically got a double stat up. Um, tears up and shot speed up, both of which will increase my damage with Libra. Came for the no pause hard mode, stay for the damper. Nice, Boogaloo. I saw uh, Cobalt's been playing FTL. If there's one thing I enjoy watching uh, on Twitch is people playing FTL for the uh, first time. Uh, it is really entertaining as somebody has put a lot of hours in the game. Definitely one of my favorite viewing experiences, watching somebody learn that game. Very entertaining. And Kobo, of course, is a great entertainer, so double the pleasure. Finger Rub, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the 20 consecutive months. Much love. Seven Hill doesn't want to sleep. Gonna watch the stream and get him to sleep. Fair enough. Enjoy your Lurk Anubis, and best of luck with that seven month old. They do have a mind of their own. So my damage threshold's okay right now. I wouldn't consider my damage good, but it's definitely not bad. It's uh, it's somewhat lacking. I find the strong opposite to be true as someone who wants to watch play Isaac. You know, I actually went back when I was playing Isaac every day. I had a really hard time watching people play Isaac. I don't know what it is about it. It's like your inner your inner backseat gamer is screaming watching somebody play Isaac. Whereas FTL, you're going, hee 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 hee, you're going to die. I don't know, it's different. Each their own though, of course. I think I guess the difference is from a viewing perspective uh, in FTL if you don't know what you're doing you're still probably gonna survive for a bit until you get to a you know catastrophic situation uh, not so much true for Isaac if you're uh, still learning Isaac you used to die a lot without any real uh, hope oh dude calm down with the fires man
No, I never backseat when I watch FTR. I let people figure it out for themselves. I never, ever, unless specifically asked for direct advice, I won't say anything. Nice, Jenny Zumi, nice. Sub tile lights him. Well, I think Super Secret Room is way on the other side. I was going to buy this Soul Heart and be on our merry way. Was this a good pill, right? Ooh, mystery pill. Pretty fly. That's definitely a uh, good mystery pill to know. No regrets. So my only stat up pill in the entire pool is a speed up pill. It would appear. I'm not going to waste bombs trying for... Um, super secret here and the reason for that being I want to save them for skulls since we had the blank card if I can get a good card or rune that could definitely turn my run around so I don't want to uh, don't want to mess around with that I want to get a card in the bank down we go We always go right first. That's my rule. I start, like I started breaking all my uh, my gameplay rules. I don't know why I did. Let me get back into my habit of playing a little more a uh, little more methodical than I have been, because I know it suits uh, my play style a lot better if I do that. Well, two down's not bad. So many keys this run. Incredible amount of keys. Well, the trick of the gurglings is just to, um... No, I do not like a parse here. No time. No time. To expand on what was said before, there's going to be more hours streamed during the week. I'm really going to be shooting for, um... My hardest for 7 p.m. to 3 a.m. Of course, if I'm sick, I might, you know, stop early or something like that. But, um... That's what I'm really going to be shooting for, is that 40 hours of broadcast time uh, per week uh, during the Monday through Friday broadcast. That means cutting out a few things. Um, going to uh, be cutting cosplay and suggested game day, both of which I very much enjoy. But uh, I'm also working on getting in shape, and that takes a lot of time out of the day. Approximately an hour per day is what I shoot for for workout or body time so I really want to I really want to get back to doing what I do and uh, streaming streaming as much as I possibly can uh, working on getting in shape and not having to worry about uh, the off broadcast stuff as much but I wanted I don't want to have that be like I need to stream less so I have more time to work on off stream stuff certainly possibilities of stuff coming back but right now uh, we're keeping cooking with frag of course um, but I'm going to focus on broadcasting for 40 hours a week, getting in shape, and uh, we'll take everything from there. So we're cutting a few things out, adding more hours in, and we'll make an adjustment then. I am uh, infamous. Really? I mean, okay, maybe. I uh, I am infamous for overextending myself. Like, I'll... Uh... Why I, t I don't know why I took that. It's really a bad item, but I did. Um, I am infamous for overextending myself. I mean, I'll take on more projects than I can actually feasibly handle. And I have I had a pretty good balance going, but then I realized I need to get in shape, and I realized how much time I'd have to spend um, working out, and it just does not does not add up. So we're gonna find a new balance. 
Now that being said, overextension I don't consider a bad thing. It just means you're pushing yourself to the limit. But uh, it's not a bad thing. It's just one of those things you have to make adjustments. If I didn't overextend myself, I wouldn't be me. I always try to push myself really hard, which is uh, one of my redeeming qualities. But it does come back to bite me, and I have over time realized when I am overextended, and you have to, uh, gotta make some changes. Why did I take Tiny Planet? <laughs> Glutton for punishment, that's why. Yeah, exactly like a parse here. Uh, the last thing I have to do in my life is get in shape. It's been a long time since I've been in shape. I've uh, I smoked for about a decade. I've never been in particularly good uh, physical shape, and I really do want to accomplish that in my life. I want to actually get in good shape. So it's gonna take some. It's gonna take some time. A lot of time, actually. Right? If we're being honest, it's gonna take me you know, a really long time to get in shape. At least a year of working out as much as I can. Um, I'll we'll just talk about my health over my life. Um, I used to be extremely overweight. And uh, let me say this, I never like felt motivated to lose weight because I was sad about the way I looked. I've always been fine with the way I looked, but I don't like the way that I feel. Um, my heaviest weight ever was 285 pounds, and that's when I was 14. I'm currently sitting at about uh, one, I hover between 190 and 200. And that's where I've been for the past uh, two and a half, three years. Uh, before that, I was at about uh, two, 230. And uh, what I did to go from 230 to where I am now is I cut like soda out of my diet. I just made some diet changes. I didn't exercise anymore, but I cut, I cut a lot of soda out of my diet and candy and stuff like that. But it's finally time now that I've given up nicotine to take the full dive. Um, take the full dive and actually get in shape. I'm 5'10". The No Name Hero, thank you for keeping a dab. I appreciate the eight consecutive months. But yeah, through simple dietary changes, uh, I stabilized myself. But that doesn't mean that my muscles are in good shape or my cardiovascular is in good shape. So I really need to work on that stuff this year. And I'm going to. Well, I kind of want to use this I can see forever pill, but I don't know, man. Let's just check this out. What's in here? Yeah, people make that circle as a shape joke, and it's really just a... Um, excuse, is what it is. I don't care about my looks, I just want to be in shape. Agent 86, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the 12 consecutive months. Look, here's what I'm going to do to get in shape, and I can tell you what I'm going to do right now. I'm not going to set up some crazy uh, diet and exercise regimen. I'm not going to. Uh, I'm not going to do high intensity interval training or run till I puke. I'm going to take one hour of each day, and I'm going to spend it working on my body. If I'm super ultra exhausted from working out every day, I can just stretch for an hour. Uh, I know the limits of my body pretty well. While I may not be in the best shape, I've definitely done plenty of stuff that has uh, pushed my body pretty far. But I'm going to spend one hour of each day working out, whether that be uh, cardiovascular, lifting weights, stretching, whatever. But one hour of each day is going to be dedicated to improving my body. And I know over time that will lead to me getting in shape because I'm not... Uh, not a complacent person, so if I start seeing results or something feels good, I'll just keep doing it. So I have started a uh, more active lifestyle, and I'm not gonna not gonna stress the details or worry about uh, dropping pounds and stuff like that. I'm just making a lifestyle change, and I know it'll work out over time, but it's going to take a lot of time. We got 15 keys, we can open this real quick. 
Yeah, I may want to. We're in Necro 1. I kind of want to save. We already have three flies. Yeah, nice. That's why you open the keys. Yes, I absolutely know that I had the willpower and dedication to do it. I did stream every day for two years, and if I can do that, uh, I do believe I can mentally overcome just about any obstacle. Holy crap, we got level 3 Meat Boy in the house, boys. Now that is really nice, because um, level 3 Meat Boy is going to really... Uh, it's going to really change some stuff for me here. Uh, Tiny Plant is not the best. I'm not sad that I took it. Uh, Helix Ripper, little hand to you, friend. Welcome to the Dapper. Thanks so much. Rules card just displays some information on, like, how to unlock the Lost or, um, yeah, does all that stuff. Or game tips. Whoa, not cool, War. Dude, come on now. There was no announcement, boss. What the fudge, tiny planet? Cheese and rice? That was really bad. We lost a lot of help there. Well, let's hope the next floor is better. Well, thank you, Helix Ripper. Appreciate it, dude. I think I'm gonna work on uh, pull-ups. I can't really do push-ups. I have um, I have a wrist injury, which really limits the mobility of this wrist. I can't actually put weight down like this on my wrist. I can do fist push-ups, but those aren't very comfortable. What? Tiny planet, please. Long and short, we'll be streaming more uh, during the week, is the gist of the announcement. I got sick this weekend, though, and was not able to make the video. Huh. Hey! Okay, Guppy's paw's really good. It's only my left wrist, fortunately, but, uh, yeah. Repetitive stress injury. No joke. Yes, yeah, so we're going to be shooting for 7 p.m. to 3 a.m. is my goal for streaming. Of course, there will be some days where I cannot make that goal, but is my goal to actually have 40 hours in the Monday through Friday um, broadcasting period. <laughs> well, a little saying then, the best shape of my life was not saying much. Yeah, I can bend it. It's still, okay, so let me just show you the difference here. It's not that much of a difference, but that's, you can see how much farther the right wrist goes back than the left, this is as far as it goes. Forward's fine, side to side's fine, but straight back is, uh, not happening. Yeah, we're definitely going to touch the pot at the very least. I just got to figure out, I don't know, I think we'll take it. Unless I can get a good card for this blank freaking card, because like right now we're sitting on, this card has done me absolutely nothing. Amadeus 484, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the nine consecutive months. Much love. Cheese and rice, the damage. Do -do -do. Pa's gonna give me soul hearts and more soul hearts uh, later on. Oh, I imagine there's a surgery to fix it, but uh, I can't really do surgery right now. And it's not really troublesome for me. This is what it is. Out of all the things I could have wrong with my body, it's a pretty minor complaint. Yeah.
Yeah, buddy, Amadeus. Yeah, buddy. All right, this is good. Uh, damage up every other shot's nice. Yep, exactly, Luggy, exactly. It's not stopping me from doing anything in my life except for push-ups, which is <laughs> not a big deal for me. Alright, you know the damage uh damage got okay here. Oh, it's because I have tiny uh the tiny shroom proc. I gotcha. The max fire rate proc there. Okay, that'll be good. Looks like we are gonna take the paw. I'm not getting any uh there's not even any skulls on these levels. That's crazy, man. Yeah, exactly, Chronicle, that's what I'm shooting for. I find working out to be somewhat boring sometimes too. It's kinda mix it up. We'll mix it up. Okay, let's go check our store. We got 14 keys. The soup guy, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate these seven consecutive months. Much love, dude. Well, you know, with sharp plug sitting there, if I can get one hero font card, I don't know. No, I need wafer too. Doesn't quite work the way I want it to. I really hope I get level 4 Meat Boy here, because if I don't, we're going to be in an uh, interesting situation. Yeah, the paw is very timid with the Eternal Art. Okay, this is going to be the make it or break it for this run, whether I take the paw or not. It's going to be, uh... Oh! This room right here, and all the skulls. So that's two batteries available as well. Okay, let's see if we can blow up here. We should get three, three each on this. Did we get any cards? Any cards? One singular sensation? No? Oh, man. Man, oh, man. Well, unless I get a really good card uh, down here somewhere, we are definitely going to take um, Guppy's Paw instead. Either way, we have to go back and touch Guppy's Paw, but wow, pretty terrible. Sometimes blank cards a lot like a PhD. You get it and then nothing comes from it, you know? That's cool, I guess. Yeah, it is pretty rare to get no cards. Definitely an odd situation. Not a complaint, just an observation game. Yeah, a lot of times blank card can carry a run pretty hard. I'm not even going to open that chest. It's not worth the double boss fight. Not with Tiny Planet. We will, um... I'm going to blow this up and then gamble, I think. Actually, what reason do I have to gamble here? I should save my coins for a beggar, if that's going to be the case. Oh, so dope. 0591, little hand to you, friend. Welcome back to the Dapper. Oh, so dope. Appreciate it, sir. Much love, brother. Much love. Yes, you did tell me it's up, and you followed through. What a legend. Good to have you back, sir.
Oh yeah, eternal heart. We're gonna we're gonna eat our hearts here. I shouldn't have done that yet. I'm gonna get a devil deal. Just wait for it. I don't think I, well, I think it bugged Tavillian because I definitely didn't see it. Oh no, I missed it. I'm sorry. Tavillian, thank you for keeping a dapper. Appreciate the five consecutive months. Much love. No, we're not gonna go up. We're gonna we're gonna stick to uh We're gonna stick to our guns. We do have level three meat boy, which is a great boss killing tool. Red mama. Red mama. Red mama. Whoa, I did that to myself, dude. Do 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 All right, mama. All right, we're gonna take the Polaroid. I'm gonna check in here. What's in here? Hey, hey, nice haul. I'm gonna go ahead and fight this boss too. Whoa, give us a chance at a god room in the. Uh... Oh, I'm out of bombs. Hey, cool, my dad, Martin. Yeah, it's been really great. Uh, big up to Andrew at Agile Cuts. Let's go. If you're looking for any uh, motion graphics, logos, uh, YouTube management, stuff like that, look up Andrew right there. He's very good, and he's really helped me streamline the um, process of archiving the VODs and stuff. Super helpful, very reasonable dude. Soul Shocks, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the 43 consecutive months. What a legendary player. Go right first. Oh, God. Yeah, get him, me boy. Get him. Get him. I so... I sincerely hope for level four Meat Boy here. That'd be so amazing. Yeah, 43 is no joke, man. That's legit. Oh yeah, those guys go over rocks, that's right. Okay, Meat Boy, you gotta get on target, son. Get on target, son. There you go. There you go. I don't know, we've, we've gotten there naturally so far. I don't even think Book of Revs is a requirement here. I mean, it'd be nice. But I don't think we need it. I mean, if we get a naturally occurring level for me, that'd be uh, pretty miraculous, to be honest. I wouldn't be sad to see Conquest, though, because flying would be a pretty big benefit here, too. It wouldn't be bad. What's this card? Two of Hearts. Not oh, good, man. Hey, thank you, Chronicle Bliss. Appreciate it. You appreciate. All right, what we got going on here? No dark rocks. No dark rocks. Come on, death. Two of hearts does me no good with um no. No red hearts. All right, it is conquest, and that's okay. Uh, I'm gonna take the flying here, uh, without question. 
um, and roll with that. Flying tiny planet is actually quite good. Okay, there's not much I could have done there to stop that. If we're being honest. Not Fred, at least. Yeah, Fred wouldn't be too bad here. It wouldn't be fun, but he'd be all right. We got a dark rock right here, too. It is kind of painful to drop the paw here, but um, a good play is better than a chance at more soul hearts. IMO. OPT Lawyer, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the 13 consecutive months. Much love. All right, we are... Um, honestly, with just level 3, maybe I can dodge my way to victory, which I might be end up doing in some rooms. Going down. Before we go down, I'm going to take a short break right here. I'm going to stand up and stretch, run to the restroom real quick. Encourage you all to do the same. In fact, another cup of coffee sounds amazing. Let's, let's do that. I'll be back in approximately um, three to five minutes. Uh, thank you all for your patience during this time. I do appreciate it. Uh, be back soon, and then we will do it to it and go down.
Alrighty, we have returned. Thank you for your patience, everybody. I appreciate it. You know, um, thinking about this, I think I should clear more on this floor. Um, I'm confident enough in the build having Meat Boy and Flying that I should be able to, uh, well, clear and potentially get pills and stuff, so... I don't see any problem with problem with clearing here with the three orbitals as well. There you go. There's more health. And now that we have health extra, we're definitely going to clear. Adalysis, thank you for keeping a damper. Appreciate the 21 consecutive months. Much love to you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Oh, bum. Tough room. Out. We do have that back, so it's okay. Oh, tiny planet, I needed that, dude. Alright, LeGrand Corgi, enjoy your lurk, sir. Appreciate you. Wow, these guys are pretty crappy with uh, this current build. Not not ideal, that's for sure. Got you, AS. There we go. You know, I'm a pretty big fan of Tiny Planets. A lot of people hate this item a lot. I think it's actually quite good. If you have decent defense like I do right now, uh, it can be a, a good way to practice dodging. There's definitely some enemy types that do not do well uh, versus that. That was one of them right there. Three bombs, good. But like a room like this, I can just literally sit in the corner. In a lot of ways, it's like having spectral tears in that regard if you have flying. Yeah, we're going to take our play back to being a lot more uh, slow, methodical, and thought out, which I've really gotten away from in Rebirth. I had a very, uh, I don't want to say unique, but a specific play style in the original Isaac, and I've really gotten away from that, I think, to my own detriment as far as uh, play style goes. I don't feel like I'm playing poorly, but I feel like I could be playing a lot better. I need to actually think through my decisions and uh, all that to make that a reality. Or bombs, okay. Let's try, let's check here real quick. I gotta go blow my nose real quick. Sorry for the short delay here. The Zycam stuff tastes really nasty. Holy crap. Be right back.
Alrighty. Oh, speaking of speaking of lurkers, let's do uh, let's do a lurker roll call. That wasn't a break, core. That was a step away. If you're lurking in the chat and you're able to post yourself a frag lurk. Where are my lurkers at? Stuff the cool guy one twenty nine. Also, we just used the break animation not even uh, ten minutes ago. Okay, so our secret room's not there. It could be here. Could be. There's the lurkers. I knew you guys were out there. Chat was awfully quiet there, but I knew you were all there. Lurking. Waiting. Hmm. Okay, well, we'll grab this chest. It's not going to be there either. It only really leaves uh, one, maybe two places for the secret room to be. One of them being down here. Which is not there, which means it's going to be over here. Or not. No, where is it though? Okay, so it can't be over there. Determine is not going to be over here because we can't go down there. We already tried bombing above the boss door. Already tried down here, I'm pretty sure. Can't be up there. Only other place it really can be would be the corner up here. So it looks like a negatory, maybe here. Wow, you know, I'm gonna let that one go. Wherever that secret room is, it can, uh, can stay there. Doing pretty good, Lay B, how are you? Very good, Faunix. We looked to the precise moment to show ourselves. Perfect, man. Perfect. Well, goodbye, Guppy's Paw. Safety net deactivated. Well, hello. What kind of room are you? Interesting. Really? I mean, uh... it's good, Simply Mortar. How are you? What's up? Let's go, bub. Glad you can make it back today, sir. I mean, I don't want to pick up fate now because the uh, the red heart's actually bad for me. What's up, Mr. Wales? Disadvantage of taking phase, I get an eternal heart, which will link me a red heart, which will negate my Polaroid shield. The only benefit of taking it is that I could potentially uh, get rid of um, the white pony, but I don't have a replacement item for that at current, so it doesn't make sense to take it. Good pill, right? No, it's tears down. Never mind. Glad to hear it. Simply Mordor, glad to hear it. Get him, dude. What are you doing, little meat man? Meat man, please. These are not your friends. This is indeed the enemy, sir. Meat man, please. Alright, soul heart there is good. Got a little safety, uh, safety net. Oh, oh, it's Butless Chubb. What a legend. Well. 
But I lost my safety and I should just go grab that heart now. But let's chub. What's up, C-Tan? That chub has no butt. Whoa! Radical! Downtown Jewel, little hand to you, friend. Welcome to the Dapper Downtown Jewel. Appreciate the port. Thank you so much for choosing to subscribe and port the content. I appreciate you more than you know. Wheel of Fortune, eh? Okay. I'll think about it. Yeah, touch the spikes. Nice. What's up, little fish, eh? Good to see you again. How are you doing today? Dude, Meat Man, you're killing me, dude. You're killing me, Meat Man. What are you doing, bro? Nothing. You want me to do something? Do I need to do something here? Okay. Meat man, you are killing me right now with this. I don't even... What are you doing with your life, bud? Not killing stuff, that's for sure. Doing alright, little fish. Everybody in my house is sick, but uh, I can't complain. Life's good. I have done ruse uh, multiple times on the uh, cooking with frags. Uh, definitely one in the stew recipe. Also in the velute recipe, we made a roux. Um, I, I think there's a third one out there too. No, it's not con crud. We got it well after, um, well after getting back. We always do real good during cons. Lots of hand sanitizer and hand washing saves the day. All right, we're gonna go clear the rest here before we fight mom. I don't have any reason not to clear. I have a very good defensive build. Awesome, downtown. You appreciate that. Uh, really enjoying doing the cooking with frag. Uh, we are making some adjustments and cutting some stuff. Uh, well, ooh, I can skip the mama fight. I just might. In fact, I should. No point in getting one key. Cooking with Frag will be staying, uh, though, for sure. I really enjoy cooking, and Cooking with Frag's been a uh, constantly good, positive thing for me. So I'm glad you enjoyed it. That was definitely worth... Um, we were going up anyways, and uh, with this current build, the Mom Heart fight's probably the hardest boss fight for me to do. Uh, the Isaac fight, not as bad with level 3 meat boy. You just have to maintain and dodge. Where? Mom's Heart is very, very hard to do with Tiny Planet. So, a bit lucky there, I'll take it. Cool, bub. Well, thanks for tuning into Ashley's stream. I'm sure she appreciated it. She told me she had a really good time streaming, which is great. You do not get an Eden token, no. Uh, for skipping the mob fight. Oh, I just had my I had my Liberty Cap proc there. I didn't use it. That was the first thing I should have done on this floor was proc my uh, my Liberty Cap. Ah! For sure the first thing I should have done. But on a good note, we have 129 Eden tokens, so I think we'll be okay. Okay, let's get our stuff proc'd again here. Do, do, do. What we're doing right now is walking back and forth between the rooms, waiting for the Liberty Cap to proc the compass and show us where um, our boss door is. Oh, 
Well, it may be worth to clear the wombs sometimes. Clearing the cathedral is generally a bad idea. Oh, come on, Liberty Cap. I got second in making any announcement videos, but long story short, we're going to be streaming more hours during the week. And I'm getting in shape. Oh, and I quit nicotine four days ago. We're shooting for more like 7 um, p.m. to 3 a.m. for the broadcast hours Monday through Friday. And then we'll do whatever on Saturday. Okay, saw it. Favorite character in Rebirth? I don't know. They're all good. Okay. Going up? Yeah, we got it. Uh, Hex says, well, I smoked on and off for 10 years, and I used e -cig for uh, about two. Oh, okay. I'm going to bomb out of here. What? How did that not work? Shenanigans. Cool little fish, hey, thanks for the offer. What? Really? Oh, man. That is rough stuff. I was really hoping for a couple soul hearts there. I have a different opinion, Hexadecimal. I think e are actually really bad for you. Uh, having used both cigarettes and e-cigs, yes, uh, e-cig definitely uh, feels a lot better, but you're really replacing one addiction for another, and anybody that's smoked an excessive amount of e-cig knows it does not make your body feel good at all. Better than smoking, for sure. Uh, I do not think they're healthy or a healthy replacement. My experience using an e-cig is... Uh, Replacing the smoking cessation with an e-cig uh, led to me actually smoking smoking uh, more than I would have smoked cigarettes, though I'm sure that's overall healthier. Um, let me just talk about... God bless it, why did I go in here? Let me talk about my story with addiction a little bit and nicotine. I have a very um, addictive personality. I always have. It's very easy for me to get addicted to things, which is a positive and a negative. Uh, the positive side to having a, an addictive personality is when you like something, you're incredibly motivated to continue doing it. And that applies not just to substances, that applies to things that you do, such as uh, being self-employed, or streaming, or having a good work ethic, all come with um, having an addictive personality. Uh, so there's definitely a lot of positives to it, but... Um, there's negatives too, and nicotine's always been one uh, major constant in my life, and I've always been uh, very addicted to it, and uh, it's going to be a little bit soapboxing, we won't have this conversation a lot, but I think it's important that we have this uh, conversation at least once on stream. Um, why nicotine is so dangerous, not just for people with addictive personalities, just but in general. Uh, I think nicotine is one of the most uh, dangerous and addictive drugs because it works its way into your daily routine without you even realizing it. I will be the first person to tell you that uh, sm I enjoy smoking. I really enjoy smoking. I enjoy the way nicotine makes me feel. Um, I enjoy the cessation of inhaling smoke. 
Uh, I love everything about smoking, except for that it's really bad for me. So, if you're not concerned about your health as much, like when you're younger, you know, 16, 17, 18, which is when I started, uh, started smoking, um, you know, it doesn't seem like that big of a deal. It's something that's enjoyable. Uh, it's a way to, it's a coping mechanism. It's something that just kind of becomes a habit. But when it starts getting really dangerous is when you start getting older and let's say uh, cigarettes find or nicotine finds its way into your daily routine. Yeah, you have your cigarette when you wake up and then of course a cigarette after a meal feels amazing. Uh, all that stuff, but the stuff that you don't think about when you're smoking for a long time is how quickly it adds up. Like maybe you get a new job and uh, your new job it has a slightly longer commute, so you add a cigarette into your driving time, so you're smoking two cigarettes instead of one, or uh, you have a schedule change and that leads up to a cigarette. And um, after a time, and it doesn't take very long, you become codependent on nicotine. And that's where I've been for a really long time between uh, cigarettes and vaping and whatever it is. You become codependent on having that coping mechanism or the cessation or just the nicotine after a time. And that's why I believe that nicotine, what? What? But I believe nicotine is the most dangerous drug of them all because it doesn't have an immediate effect where like, yeah, you can tell somebody's been smoking meth for a year because it really fucks you up. But cigarettes, probably not so much. It's not something that you uh, perceive by looking in the mirror. It takes a very long time um, to get to the point where you realize that you should have quit a long time ago. I'm speaking from uh, the perspective of somebody that has an addictive personality. Uh, we all know smoking's bad. Everybody knows smoking bad. Everybody knows it's chemically addictive. But speaking as somebody that's had um, a long relationship with nicotine and has an addictive personality, I will always, every time I smell smoke or smell a cigarette, I'm going to want to smoke. And I know that's something I have to live with the rest of my life. Uh, I gave up, ooh, Suicide King. I gave up my right to enjoy smoking when I became codependent on nicotine. I can't have a casual cigarette. It's just not something I can do because it's not good for me. And uh, I've quit smoking and started smoking um, five or six times in my life. And uh, it really, your brain is so ready to trick you and to start smoking again. I think my personal favorite for starting smoking again, I'm going to smoke this cigarette to prove to myself that I beat nicotine. I've done that one like three times. And uh, every time that happens, I end up, smoking one cigarette and then two and then seven and then I bought a pack of smokes. I started looking at my addiction from a much different perspective when I decided I wanted to get in shape and I've realized that nicotine itself I cannot have that in my life if I want to get in shape. It's just not a substance that can be there whether it be through uh, e-cig or cigarettes or whatever. Uh, it's not I cannot have nicotine in my life if I want to get in shape, and that is my main motivator. Because I know my brain will trick me into wanting to smoke, and I've done it enough times now that I know that where that path leads every single time. And then after I was done thinking about it like that, I started thinking about how much time in my life had been spent thinking about smoking, or when I can smoke next, or... Uh, you know, when when's my next cigarette or when's my next puff? And I don't want that. I don't want that anymore. So we gave it up like four or five days ago. Five days ago now. You're never not addicted once you start smoking. You just don't smoke. Exactly. Uh, that's exactly what it is. It always surprised me, uh, even when I quit, how strong the urge is to smoke, even if you haven't smoked in like a year. So I've quit, um, and I feel really good about it. I feel like I have the correct justification to make it to make it work because I really do uh, want and need to get in shape. So that's my experience with smoking and nicotine. I thought I'd throw that out there uh, at least once here on the broadcast because uh, I have an extremely addictive personality, um, and it's treated me pretty good during my life. But there's definitely some negatives to it.
Yeah, but I started again, Naruki. Not too long after that. I'm not going to sit here and tell you to quit smoking yourself, but I will encourage you to think about uh, think about your addiction, perhaps in some different terms than you have been. Ooh, I don't know, man. This is not great. I mean, poly is good, but I don't have the fire rate to back it up. Or I can? Interesting. Apparently that didn't affect my fire rate very much, which is uh, odd. Okay, so we put ourselves in a pretty precarious situation. I took like four damage I shouldn't have while I was talking about smoking there. Bummer. Oh no, give me frickin' proptosis. God, that sucks. That sucks. Because Libra, that's right. Okay, dude, I need you to get over here and do this. Thank you. That's what I need right now. Got it. Oh, I forgot about the old Proptosis Tiny Planet uh, conundrum. That was definitely my bad. Whoa, dude! Shit. Not good. Not good. Extropiss, thank you for keeping a damper. Appreciate the 19 consecutive months. Much love to you. Okay, now we're gonna walk back and forth and see where our boss door is. I'm gonna hope it's left and then down. It's not. God bless. Why, God, why? Yep, I don't, don't I'm not going to sit here and uh, preach to you guys about not smoking and stuff. I've done plenty of stuff in my life. I've been addicted to lots of, lots of stuff. I'm not going to sit here and tell you that you have to quit smoking and you're going to die or anything, but I do encourage you to uh, think about it. Think about your addiction and what it actually, uh, how much of your life is encompassed by that addiction. God bless. God bless. Okay, I'm never taking Tiny Planet again. Never. I'm just not doing it. If I didn't have Tiny Planet right now, this build would be uh, awesome. But we do. Triple green peep, even worse than bloat. Alright, so I learned my lesson there. Never take Tiny Planet, even if you think it's going to be cool. Because it's not. Because it's not. That's okay, we'll uh, start that one over. Okay, what do we start with here? Unicorn Stump and... The Mark. Okay. I learned my lesson. I got a little bit, uh, sidetracked there talking too, but... My fault. What are you? Spelunker hat, okay. That's the final straw. Smoky his way, cost an Isaac. That's okay. That's okay. Do, 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 do. Well, this room is going to take a smidge to clear, that's for sure. No, there's not, Dane I didn't have. I got sick this week and did not make the videos. Uh, the short and long of it is we're going to be streaming more hours during the week. I'm really going to push hard for 7 p.m. to 3 a.m. during the Monday through Friday broadcast. Uh, also, I quit nicotine and I'm going to be uh, working on getting in shape this year, which comes with a few changes for the broadcast. Um, obviously, we're getting more hours in, which is great, but have to cut a few things. Going to cut uh, suggested game day and cosplays. We're going to keep the mystery basket cooking with frag and cooking with frag. Um, but I'm going to focus on getting more hours in again. Uh, the past year and a half has been absolutely nuts for me uh, individually, but we're finally at a point where life is uh, a lot more stable now. Um, 
So I really want to focus on getting back to the broadcast, getting in shape, and uh, not worrying about too much of the off-broadcast stuff. Uh, I had a really good balance if I was not taking time to work out and diet and exercise and stuff, but since I made that choice, I have to give up something off the broadcast, but I, did, I don't want that to come at the cost of hours uh, streamed. So we're actually adding more hours in and cutting a few of the off-broadcast things. Okay, well, the secret room's there. I can bomb into the, um, tonight, Yarn Before Farm. It's not a guarantee. My guaranteed streaming hours are still 9 p.m. to 12 a.m., and if I'm not feeling up to it, I'm not going to kill myself to go to 3 a.m., but I'm really going to push hard to do so. Interesting floor layout indeed, Mr. Amphid. That is. Look at that. Okay, so Splunker Hat is letting me see that. We're definitely going to check out the regular secret room, um... First. Okay, yeah, I didn't open, I just saw it because of the Spelunker. That's fair. No, Cooking with Frag is not going anywhere. I really enjoy doing Cooking with Frag, and I'm happy to take the time off broadcast to make that work. I also had a, a ton of fun doing the um, Cooking with Frag Mystery Basket. So we'll be dropping everything basically down tiers, so that'll be a lot more accessible and hopefully we'll maintain that. Well, I might as well blow these up to see if there is um, crawl space or something. Highly unlikely, but possible. It's possible. Dalla Bill 28, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the 23 consecutive months. Much love, dude. Caffeine pills good for the speed up, I guess. This uh, fire rate's pretty suspect. Will do, Dalabil. Thanks for your continued support, man. You the real MVP. Okay. One coin. That's it, then. All right. Alright, so we got Splunker Hat. It's actually a pretty helpful item. I'm really hoping I can get like a Orbital that does damage, because then the Unicorn Stump becomes incredibly powerful. Uh, Morlithon, if you press up against the wall and hold the direction against the wall, they will not charge at you unless they reach the edge of the wall. Um, it's a pretty cheesy way to kill the Gurgles, and very effective. Dude, that's Spider-Man. Where are you booking it to, son? Balls. Come on, man. Dude! Is this real life right now? Is this real life? This is not a hard room either. Well, he did spawn a lot of spiders. This is not a hard room. Whew. Hey, hey, nice Amphid. Well played, sir. Well played. Doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo. Well, I might as well look then. Come on, raw liver. They were aggroing pretty hard. I agree, Kakashi.
To answer your question, Azaro, I will always be open for people's game suggestions, but I will, I will say this. I was thinking about it yesterday. I've been the exact same type of video game player my entire life. I like to pick one game, and I like to get as good as I possibly can at it, and then I mix in other games. This has not just been a streamer thing for me. I've always played video games this way. I want to be really good at the games <laughs> I do play. Deadly Foxy, thank you for keeping a damper. Appreciate the 12 consecutive months. Much love. And I really don't see that changing in the foreseeable future. I understand a lot of people want to see a lot of different games, but the reality is I want to get back to getting uh, very good at Isaac, and that'll take time and dedication and training, which I'm willing to put in. What I don't want is people to have an expectation of me playing other stuff, because it's just going to get, um, it's well, it's going to get wrecked. Because no matter what I do play, I'm rightfully probably never going to be a true variety streamer. One, because I don't think the format works, and two, because I like being really good at the games I do play. It's not a matter of getting um, bored of them. It's a matter of... Uh, that's how I play games. Yeah! Nice pattern. Nice. Pattern within a lie. Little hand to you, friend. Welcome to the Dapper. And congratulations on your random Mega set Satan win. Satine win. What a player. Yeah, I, I'd imagine there will be a Bob transformation. There should be. Dude, this, uh, this run right now is just terrifying. I don't want to go into a 2x2 two two room with a half heart. I, mean, I could I could bomb or something, I don't know. Mega Satin, super smooth. Cool pattern. Dark Z, triple nine. Thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the six consecutive months, sir. Thank you for the awesome half year, man. Appreciate you. Well, we survived the two by two room. That's nice. Kythan, thank you for keeping a dapper. Appreciate the 18 consecutive months, sir. Much love. Do, do, do. Cheers, Power of the Light. Many more to come. Could have been a much worse room for a half art, yes. Although those jumping spiders are always a bit uh, RNG heavy, so we got lucky. Well, I got a couple of choices what to do if I don't get a uh, heart in this room. Um, one, I can open up the three double chests inside of the curse room. All right, little fishing. Check you later. Vladimir von Hackenslash. A little hand to you, friend. Welcome to the damper, Vladimir von Hackenslash. What a name! What a player. Aaron Zoaz, thank you for keeping a damper. Appreciate the five consecutive months. Much love. Well, it is true. I can't get a health down right now. If I get a tier rate down, uh, I might as well just call the urn right there.
I mean, I can also get in and possibly out of the combat room if there's spiders in there. Good. Now, you got there, Vladimir. This probably just didn't show up for you since you, um... Didn't refresh after subscribing. You're good. No shame, sir. No shame. Mr. Saturn Boing, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the five consecutive months. Much love. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and buy the heart in the store, which is what three three coins for a half heart. Woo! Then we're gonna do the um, combat room. Yeah, we just lost a run too because I took Tiny Planet on purpose. Which, my bad. Never take Tiny Planet without piercing tears. Even then, it's um, questionable. Unfortunate. I was really hoping for a uh, soul heart there. Big time. It's all right, we're staying alive. Really hoping for a famine, which is probably not gonna happen here, but it's possible. Not likely. All right, after we fight the boss, I will uh, go back for the Cursed Room. Uh, we can go in there with one heart since I have the uh, Unicorn Horn. We can get in for free and then possibly out for free if it is spiders. Yeah, fair enough, Nassar. I need uh, I, I need to improve my play, though. I, as I said earlier in the broadcast, I really... Uh, I really got away from my own playstyle in Isaac in Rebirth. I started playing a lot faster, a lot less methodical. Um, in the original Isaac, I was a very, uh, very methodical player. I just I got away from that for some reason, and I want to get back to it. Well, we're most 100% taking Mr. Squeezy here because my fire rate sucks, and that's plus two soul hearts. Okay, I'm not gonna, for a half heart, no. I mean, uh, okay, I, ha I had a thought there. My thought was, okay, I can get both those soul hearts if I uh, use the unicorn stump to get in the cursed room and then come back out for a half heart. But that's banking on not taking a half damage there. If I took a half damage inside the cursed room, I'd be crushed. Oh, okay. What it does, Space Ghost, is uh, it's like an ethical ad blocker. So if you're watching a streamer and they play an ad with Twitch.tv Turbo, they don't, you don't see an ad, but they get a 100% ad fill ratio, which means that they get credit for every ad that they play while you're Turbo on the channel. Um, if, you use ad, if you use just straight ad blocker, then the, the broadcaster gets nothing for when they play an ad for you. So uh, it supports the site and the broadcasters. If you watch a lot of streamers, um, Turbo is a great option. Um, if you only watch a couple streamers, I would say subs a better value. That's just me though. Two out of three guppy, yes. Let's see if we can pull it together to be uh, what we need. And how incredibly happy am I now that I took those soul hearts? I didn't even. Uh, Yes, if you're running ad block and turbo, they don't get ad fills. So yes, if you are, if you are, um, if you are a turbo person, please do whitelist Twitch on your ad blocker. Otherwise, it kind of defeats the purpose. But of course, subscribers will not see ads at any point on my broadcast since I got my sub button while we're there. it was still in the beta feature. It's not a uh, da, 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 da. ads are not a thing for subs on my channel. Get Rex Spider. Such a bad room with low damage. One of the worst. No, absolutely not, uh, Merliathan. As long as it plays, uh, that's the thing. You're more than free to mute ads. It does not affect uh, ad fill ratio at all. 
even for for broadcasters like if it's um I don't know if they still have those, but if, like, longer ads you can skip, uh, that would not affect the rate. Uh, broadcasters, to my knowledge, are all on a flat CPM, so if you see an ad, it counts as one exposure. Whether you, uh, whether you skip the ad or anything else, it's just one exposure per one ad scene. Actually, my best Eden streak, we've only attempted, um, say, serious. I've only had uh, three Eden streaks over 10, and one of those ended at 54. So, sincere thank you to those that do watch advertisements. I really do appreciate it, but uh, I've moved away a lot from the uh, ads every hour format. Not as viable as it used to be. Six room, my goodness. I'm already two out of three guppies. This is actually quite tempting. Uh, I guess we have... Oh, man, I got a lot of good stat items here. We got Mark. I can't do that. I can't do that. I want to so bad. But frankly, <laughs> my stats to start this run were really, really, really bad. Uh, and I have two, um, God bless you, two, um, whoa, tier rate up items. So if I get a bad roll on that six room, it is, it is suicide. A 62, that's right. 62, 64, or something like that. Um. But yeah, I haven't really done very many Eden streaks. Uh, we'll definitely... I'm really kind of waiting to afterwards kick in the next gear, but I want to practice on Eden, so I think it's a good one to practice on. Six Room is very interesting, though, yes. Uh, I guess if I had decent re-rolls available on the rest of the floor, like this shit right here, uh, it could definitely be worth it. Man, I know those letters have to spell something. I, it's not coming to me. BT6 30 IL, little hand to you, friend. Welcome to the damper. Thank you so much for the support. Um, if I just slaughtered your name, do let me know, and I will. Uh, will do my best. I will do my best. Yeah, really, Notch Pickaxe is kind of selling it for me here. We'll see what's in our store, because you can reroll uh, the six room reroll, real reroll store stuff, to my knowledge. Six does a uh, six does everything. Oh, stop cornering yourself, sir. Stop. Okay. Well, Soul Heart's good, as is Pandora's box, as is Blue Candle. You know what, I am at no wins right now, but... I want to play consistently, so I don't think I should really take risks that I normally wouldn't just because I don't have a streak. I think I should play it like I would play it every other time. For consistency's sake. All right, we're two out of three Gupster. We can reroll into Gupster. I'm going to, uh, well, blow this up real quick. Okay. So I bring this up to 21. I've got, uh, I got an idea here. We're going to buy the Soul Heart. We're going to buy Pandora's box. All character items and all items on floor. Right. So we have Unicorn Horn sitting in there. Um, we're gonna run this up to... If it kills me, it kills me. We'll get there. Okay. So we're gonna drop the Pandora's box in here. I don't really care about that, so we'll roll it. That's Ipecac. Uh, great, I got Guillotine with Ipecac. This, uh, that's so nice. You're so, I'm so blessed right now. And Shielded Tears. Alright, it's going to make Ipecac uh, somewhat difficult to work with, but you know what? We'll make it work. Frickin' guillotine. Frickin' guillotine shielded tears. I 
Brilliant indeed. Oh wow, crack in the sky. This is really paying off. Oh crap, I have Isaac's heart. I didn't see that. That's not good. Budge, man. Alright, well that's why you don't do six rooms. Stuff Man of Doom, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the 13 consecutive months. Oh man, this is so bad. Okay, that's it. I'm, I'm exiting now. I'm done. I'm done with that one. New run. New streak. New token. So we've learned quite a few things there. One, science is bad. Don't ever science. Okay, we got Mulligan, and uh, that's probably like my only opportunity to ever reset on a streak. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that. New streak. No regrets. Not a single regret was had. Yes, that's exactly why I should not take the chance. I had a winning build before that. That was one of the... I think that might have been the worst reroll I've ever had in a, in a six room for sure. Trader Tommy, a little hand to you, friend. Welcome to the damper, Trader Tommy. Appreciate it. I would say for earlier floors, fire rate is more important than um, damage. Never trust science, but always observe and report. Always. Yeah, Hourglass is not about item at all. <coughs> oh man. I'm looking at six rooms and one rooms right now, just like he would uh, pills. Use them in desperation, not for a chance at something better. That is a lot of red HP for Eden. That's not always a good thing. I want to sneeze. I don't want to sneeze. That was my not sneezing face. Pretty intense, huh? What are you? Philapathy for dummies. No thanks. I'm no dummy. That's a book. At least it wasn't Bob's brain, or anti grav tears, or magnetic tears. Just got McDonald's at 11.30 p.m. I'm still pretty ill right now. I'm not going to lie. Uh, I think my bi-yearly McDonald's might be happening tonight. I get, I get McDonald's twice a year, and I think today might be the day. Being six the one time where I just don't, I don't care about my diet. I just eat whatever sounds good. And I think that's fair. I think if you're sick, you deserve to treat yourself. Oh yeah, that's uh, that's the one off Ohio Street. Is that is that what it is? Yeah, yeah, it's not far at all. King Street, yeah, it's like a couple. Yeah, that's over. That's over by um, yeah, P and P. What you said. I just got I just got there and figured out what your abbreviation meant. Hey, dude, why don't you? Okay, I'm gonna go over here. And I'm gonna force you out the hole. All right, there you go. Get flushed out, son. I'm hoping there's going to be more items or ways to remove curses. Like, maybe there'll be like a beggar you can pay 15 cents to remove your curse, because that'd be awesome. Dathrax, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the 10 consecutive months. Much love.
one thing I need. Oh man, really? Can I can I have a bomb? Any bomb, please. I really need to work on is uh, focusing on how to clear each room, which when we get into Afterbirth, I'm going to start focusing on a lot more and talk about uh, the different ways to clear. In the original Isaac, granted there was a lot less rooms, uh, I had a pretty clear, uh, pretty clear idea of how to clear each room. There's a no curse mode when you play it? Probably not. Oh, little baby key. Too Long Didn't Read, uh, we're going to be streaming more during the week, Wretched, shooting for 7 p.m. to 3 a.m. every night that I can. Um, I gave up nicotine, and I'm beginning in shape. So what that means for the stream is I'm going to be cutting a few of the extra curricular, curricular stuff, uh, such as cosplay and uh, suggested game day to make time to make sure I'm working out and getting all the hours in that I can. Um, for the near future. Solid motion, little hand to you, friend. Welcome. Want to say back to the dapper. Thank you so much, solid motion. I appreciate you. What a good boy. Oh, streaming more, working out, and uh, that's it. Hey, thank you, solid motion. Appreciate it. I know, Joker, it's a real bummer. I know. Okay, my fire rate is absolute crap for this fight, which is unfortunate. That's okay, though. We'll live, maybe? God, it's like trying to do this fight with Eve. It's just... If I had bombs right now, I would so use them, just because it saves time. Yeah, he was already asleep uh, when she brought him over here. So. That's what Winston does. I disagree, Dane Lindra. I think it has a lot of legs. I think cosplays are a great idea. It's a matter of cutting uh, stuff out of my life to make sure I have time for the important stuff, like streaming enough and uh, getting healthy. So I don't think there's anything wrong with cosplay. I think they're great. Yeah. Perfect practice makes perfect. Yeah, okay, I'm just gonna face roll this one. Jesus. Yeah, I could have done that a lot better and safer, but oh my god. Don't have the fire rate to make it work. Squeezy, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Squeezy. Winston kicks the ferrets out of their bed so he can sleep in it. He's a jerk. Well, we got basically base fire right now. Yay. My goal is to spend one hour a day working out or working on my body, whether it be stretching or cardio or lifting weights. I think that's very measurable. That's how I do goals, is I set amount of time to do something. I find, I find goals like, oh, I want to lose X pounds to be a lot more depressing and hard to achieve than I'm going to spend an hour a day doing this. Scytherox. Thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the five consecutive months. Much love. Well, let's go ahead and fight the boss now. It's early enough. Yay, yeah, hey, Monstro. So much better than Duke. Do 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 do. I don't think so, Tame Knight. Let's check, though. 
It did not. Tame Knight, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate these six consecutive months. Uh, notifiers have always been wonky tame, but uh, thank you for the wonderful six months. I appreciate it. All right, that's good. And wow, all right, all right. This does kind of screw over my um, ability to gamble, but who cares, right? Did it really? Let's see it. I don't think it showed up for me. Yeah, can not confirm it didn't show up on my screen. But thank you for your support and love your lurk. Anything's possible, Stiffy, but as I said, I want to focus on broadcasting hours and getting in shape right now. I never uh, like to say never and rule stuff out because I don't think it's good. But at the same time, I don't want to get anybody's hopes up about anything. Because expectations are one of the hardest things to combat as somebody that does this for a living. What I will, uh, I want your expect expectation to be that I will be here uh, for eight hours a night as consistently as I possibly can and that I'm working on getting in shape. That should be your expectation. I will say I enjoyed cosplay, so I would definitely wouldn't rule it out. But I have to focus on what I have time to do right now. She's not in the chat right now, I don't think, uh, Stain. Yes, the damage is suddenly very real. No key is a bummer, but, uh... I wonder... Is it 7 in? Rowan2011, little hand to you, friend. Welcome uh, to the Dapper Rowan. I appreciate it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Sure, right there. Why would I bomb there? It doesn't even make sense. I was trying to bomb here, and that really did screw me over. Ouch. That was my mistake. Oh, mistakes were made, man. Mistakes were made. That's okay, we're gonna gamble here for keys. If you don't give me a key, I'll stab you in the face, beggar man. Think this is a game? Three bombs, cool. Doing great, Tiny Bubble. How are you? Nice keys. Okay, let's go check our item room now. I definitely did not execute very well there. Uh, once again, going too fast for my own good. Though with knife and pact, we should be alright, you know. Well, Ouija board just messed up my face, but... Wow, that's a, that's a face for sure. You could have used the troll bomb to open the bomb chest, that's true. I could have. I have three bombs and there's three things to blow up in this room. Coincidence? I think not. What's up, Rock Vault? Two keys out of the slot machine. Noise. That's true, I don't want to give up an entire heart just to go in there. You know what, I'm going to stop at five coins here. I think that's a good idea. See you later. We got golden keys, so we can open this now. And we can go check our store. And we can possibly find our secret room, which should be right here. Yeah, it doesn't have to help, it just have to... Just have to like it, that's all. Ghost knife. Woo -wee -wee -wee. I 
Well, we were hoping for a key. It wasn't meant to be. Good night, dangerous state. Yeah, white coffee is pretty intense, Rockfall. Very tasty, though. Bin Talk, the mind taker. Woo! It is a welcome back, Rowan, and I did know that. My apologies, sir. Welcome back, and thank you for the continued support, man. Love you. A face only a mother could love, except for she doesn't. Sad story of Isaac. Yeah, white coffee is absurdly delicious, without question. It's very good. Very tasty. Doo -doo. Whatever you say, Vladimir. You know, I can't tell you you're wrong. You know, beauty, beauty is in the eye of the beholder, as they say. Eat it up, 86. Thank you for keeping it down for the past 14 months. You're the real MVP, man. It's been a rough night, Frag Ferret, but uh, no complaints on my end. Shadow Bliss Craig, uh, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the 22 consecutive months. That'll do. Uh, white coffee is definitely a thing. Pretty rough, Simvito. We lost Tiny Planet Run, then we got super trolled by a six room. And now we're playing for serious. This is the run, I'm sure of it. God bless America. Where was it, Trader Tommy? I didn't see it. Oh, no soul hearts for me. Okay, then. M-R-M-S-T-Y. Thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the nine consecutive months. Start at the bottom left with the rocks and spikes. Okay. We'll get it on the way back, then. Whoa, 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 whoa. Haunt. What a legend. All right, we're going to check for secret room locations here. Okay, it can't be there. That's good, actually. I'm kind of hoping it's going to be next to the uh, secret room here. Or curse room, excuse me. Ah, there it is. What's up, Archangel? How you doing today, sir? Do, 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 do. It can very well be here, and I hope it is, so I get my curse room for free. It was not. Well, uh, that means it's going to be over here, which is fine. Uh, 
Oh yeah, because the stream doesn't connect. You're right. Annihilate. Correcto mundo. Still worth it a chance for the mushroom. Let's just go do the cursed room now. Hey, nice. Net gain. I like it. I like it a lot. Do, 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 do. Doing pretty good, not a spider. Uh, I got sick this weekend and unfortunately did not make the video I wanted to, Archangel, but the uh, the long and short of it is going to be streaming more hours now, uh, shooting for 7 p.m. to 3 a.m. Monday through Friday, uh, with optional Saturday streams still. Um, quit smoking and uh, working on getting in shape which means I'm dropping a couple things uh, cosplay and the suggested game day we're gonna keep cooking with frag mystery basket and cooking with frag but that's what I have time to focus on so we're focusing on less things a little more intensely uh, rather than spreading myself out so much which I think is gonna be better overall just focusing on more more stream hours. Uh, really, my life has been super duper crazy over the past uh, year and a half or so. So, uh, streaming for eight hours a night was not really a possibility with all the stuff I had going on. But uh, all the tough stuffs out of the way. We got the pinball studio fully set up. Uh, got the marriage done. Got the entire house rearranged. Daughter started school. All that stuff. So I'm now in a position where I can really start focusing on the broadcast more and that's exactly what I want to do. You know, I kind of wonder uh, if I don't have a lot of keys, if it's even worth... Oh! Jesus. At this point, going into those rooms... Probably is. But what if it's not? Like, what's the best thing um, I can get in there? I'm, I'm really excited to get uh, my Star Nation Generation fixed uh, sometime in the next couple months. I'm really misplaying that one. I got several projects for pinball I can work on, but uh, pinball will probably be more of a end of the night thing like we've been playing, but repair stuff will probably happen on Saturdays when I'm doing that. No, rightfully, past getting the Adams family back together, uh, don't have that much left. Do you use that Galaxy tablet for monitoring the stream? No, not at all. I actually use it to watch chat sometimes when I'm broadcasting, that's it. Yeah, I like my Zectangular, um... One of the awesome viewers here, Wonko T. Sane, uh, offered to look at it for me. Uh, opening up an arcade uh, very close to my house, so he's going to take a look at it when he's in town, which I really do appreciate. <laughs> so I'm in way over my head on that one. Uh, hopefully by this time next year I will not be in over my head. But uh, thank God for the internet and the amazing people here for helping me out. Yeah, five room and lots of chests. I guess that's about it. Five room, just for being a five room, is probably, uh, probably worth. Hazard 410, what's up, dude? Game Panda plays. Thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the two consecutive months. Much love. Here we are again. Oh, we got a half heart in there. I'm gonna go in here. What's uh, what's two room is uh, D20 for this one room. Well, that could have been a lot better. Oh, is there anything else I can drop in here? Not really. Computer equip. Thank you for keeping it down. We appreciate the 26 consecutive months. So many resubs today. It's beautiful. Beautiful. 
I really should try to gamble here because I did pick up the Celtic Cross. Uh, bedrooms are only on the boarded up, um, boarded up room, so no, it cannot be in that occasion. Oh, I got three red hearts in here. Nice. I miss somebody in there. Held across a lower 15% uh, chance. Uh, I don't believe you can reroll your own bombs, no. Troll bombs, maybe, but uh, not sure on that. I know in the old Isaac you could reroll uh, tower cards, but I'm not sure on this one. However, if this uh, machine blew up into a blood bank or a IV bag, might be a different story. After this, we're gonna go uh, fight the boss and hopefully get another heart. Can't reroll troll bombs, okay. Figured as much. Ooh, a dime, you're a beautiful person. Either we're gonna get a health up uh, or not, although. Unless it's a really good devil deal, I don't think I'll take it so I can gamble a bit here. Time will tell. The uh, stopwatch, or not the stopwatch, the hourglass plus knife works out pretty good. Not much tech deke, how are you, sir? Yeah, the damage is pretty great. Well, all stats up is definitely a thing I want. I knew it was cramps, I had a feeling tingling in my toes. Yeah, I'll take this over the hourglass. It's pretty good. Yeah, I can blow up mushrooms to get pills for the two room as well. Definitely a thing if I find any. I have often got the all set up mushroom in this room too, so I like I like blowing up the mushrooms here. If you get dead center, you can get all six. I think that's perfect right there. Yeah. I'm not going to take the pills, but I am going to drop them in the two room. Kramer's head shoots out a four-way brimstone. Ah, balls. Quite OP. Kramis' head's uh, a really bad room clear or a uh, boss killer, more or less. Okay, we still have not found our secret room here. We know it's not going to be there. I really should have checked here before using two keys. I'm just going to guess that it's here. So I basically wasted two keys there by not um, doing that. See, I still think that Kramps' head's a great item in a six-room charge, but I've always been very conservative with my um, item usage. Good morning, Relic Killer. What's good, sir? All right, well, here we go. Nice, we got the, that proct. Good. Kind of ideal situation here is I get... Um, nice, keep on procking. Oh, yeah, it's still a great item. It, it was better before, without question. Wow, the th triple proc on that, that's amazing. Okay, that is not uh, what I wanted, but I will take that. Um, 48 coins, we'll gamble here. Any pills that drop, I'll roll over that two room to re-roll. Um, hopefully get an orbital or six. Right, Winston? Look at those jelly beans. Look at those jelly beans. Good evening, Ganache. Let's double gamble here. We'll mix it up. Play two hands at once.
But like that little mistake I made there by not bombing and checking the secret room before using keys is like the kind of habit I need to break and be a little more meticulous in my play uh, if I want to get some really big streaks going in Afterbirth, which I do. I do. Don't kick me in the back of the head, Winston. I feel you're down there. What's up, Hasty Apple? Do, 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 do. Do 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 do. Uh. Hacking is exhausting. It is. Do. All right, let's uh, let's just bomb that. That's cool. All right then. Two room, a go go. Eternal heart. Don't really want. Eh, I'll just I'll just take this and go. Three red hearts is about the max you want if you're gonna try to drop hearts at any point, and we are trying to drop hearts for sure. Do 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 do. All right, let's uh, let's head on down deeper into the rabbit hole. Look at those jelly beans. I'm sorry, Winston. I'm sorry. No, don't leave me. I'm sorry, buddy. I'll never wake you up again. I promise. Not once. Okay. Once a moose. Thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate these seven consecutive months. Once a moose. Appreciate you. Oh, balls. That was kind of a waste of that, for sure. It was a waste of that. Ah! The waste. I do sell lies. I'm gonna wake him up tomorrow. I can't resist touching him. He's too cutie. You're too cutie, Winston. Between me and my daughter, he gets picked up like 150 times a day. That's the truth. I'd like to take a moment here to thank those that do use the Amazon affiliate service. One of the easiest ways to support the content. All you have to do is bookmark that link right there, lethalfrag.com slash alinks.htm, and use that as your entrance to Amazon. Everything will look, work, and cost exactly the same. The only difference is your uh, your support. So thank you uh, to those who take the five seconds to bookmark. That is a huge help. Also, while we're on the subject, I might as well link this up. We have created this uh, gift list, and this has a lot of stuff that uh, we use around the house and recommend everything on that list we have um, used and enjoyed the product. So if you're looking to get ahead on your Christmas shopping or just wondering what kind of stuff we use, that's a good, good reference. Everything on there is something I personally uh, approve. Not just throwing it on there to uh, boost sales. <clears throat> Those sales are nice. I appreciate sales. Okay, let's uh, let's bomb into our item room then. Catter size is 150 days. Yeah, lose way fast. Well, thank you, uh, Black August. Appreciate it. Ellen Sayer, a little hand to you, friend. Welcome back to the Dapper Ellen Sayer. Appreciate it. 
Much love. Three room is three rolls all pick up items on current floor D20. That's that nice, actually. Unfortunately, there's not going to be an arcade on this floor. We could really uh, generate some goods. Yeah, I know. Coffee just doesn't do what it used to do uh, for me. Um, as far as keep me awake. Coffee is more of like a... This is what my brain chemistry needs. Not so much. Uh... Ooh, pH freaking D. Yes. Yes. D20 rerolls anything that's like a bomb, key, heart, coin, uh, everything that's not on a pedestal or an actual item is rerolled by the D20. Hey, thank you, Elensei. I appreciate it. It has been a while. But welcome back to you. I appreciate you. Yeah, BFF Daddy Long Legs puts in some major slammage. Oh my god, Stiffy. I get a flu shot every year because I've only had the flu once and I figured that uh, the way the flu shot makes me feel um, is better than getting the flu uh, by a very wide margin. Oh my god, I got so mad last year. I got so mad last year because I was talking about how crappy I felt after getting my flu shot like I do every every year getting the flu shot and some some chatter went on a big diatribe about how the flu shot doesn't actually make you feel bad it's all psychosomatic and i almost lost it i, I legit i was like probably the closest i've ever been to losing it on stream because every year when i get my flu shot i feel awful for two days but it is so so much better than actually getting the flu like it's a hundred times better but man that was uh, probably the closest I've ever been to blowing up on somebody on stream. I was like this close. I was I was really close. Not my proudest moment, but man was I cheesed. Okay, this is death one, so we can safely fight the boss before uh, doing anything else. Oh, I like coffee. Yeah, there's nothing wrong. I don't have anything wrong with coffee. I like coffee a lot. I don't have any plans on quitting nicotine. I, or not nicotine, uh, caffeine, because I like caffeine. I've always liked caffeine. It makes me feel good. I like drinking hot beverages, too. Okay, I'd say we are safe to uh, use this three room now. The only bummer here is we have um, Curse of the Curse of the Maze, which actually moves stuff around. It like shuffles the room locations. It will keep the Chaos card for sure. Should have checked that pill, but I didn't. Hippo Taco, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the five consecutive months, dude. Much love, man. Much love. Yeah, we got a couple of gold chests spawn. It's like three of them, actually. That's good. Come on, quit moving around, you wild and wacky rooms. Oh, that's right. It rerolls shop stuff. That's the main benefit of the three room. I forgot all about it. Um... It turns the items that are, would have been like uh, bombs and keys into actual buy items, which is good. I hope our Rick and Morty is updated tonight so we can watch the new one. Man can dream. It is. You got the email. Nice. Keep it. Get swifty. Get swifty. 
All right, we are, um, we're going to take a short break here. I'll be back in approximately uh, three to five minutes. I want to say thank you, everyone, for your patience and understanding during this time. When we return, we'll head down to the depths, too, with our BFF knife, knife build. It's looking really good. Active Ginkgo, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the uh, 18 consecutive months. I'll be back. I'll be back shortly, and then we'll uh, we'll head on down. Much love, guys. Much love. I think I'm gonna have a Coca-Cola because I can. I'm sick. Holy crap! I didn't see, did. Did I completely miss her or just not show up? It apparently didn't show up. Let me say this. Pawnbroker1, a little hand to you, friend. Welcome to the Dapper, and thank you so much for your support and continued support. Uh, I appreciate you. I think you're amazing. And uh, are you legit a pawnbroker? I think notifications are a bit wonky tonight. Yeah, I didn't see it either. Okay, well, good. Let's have uh, let's get some hands up in the air for Pawnbroker One. Welcome to the frickin' Dapper, sir. I think you're amazing and wonderful and a kind person. Didn't miss it. It was over the weekend. Okay, well, um, all the same, all the same. Cyber Warlock sixty nine. Thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the nineteen consecutive months. I will return shortly, ladies and gentlemen. No, no, I won't. I'll be back right now because we got a little hand to Wildland Firefighter. Welcome to the Dapper, a Wildland Firefighter. Much love. I, I can feel the love. It's it's washing over me. I can't make Winston little hand because he'll be very mad at me. Sorry, he started making this noise when I bug him. He's making it. it means he's really mad at me. Be right back.
Alrighty, we have returned. Sorry, Winston, I'm sorry. What a good kitty. Did we get everything done on this floor that we wanted to? Uh, we did not check for the super secret, which I'm going to do right now because it should be right here. It's not. All right, if that's the case, we're just going to go then. I am satisfied. We're also holding on to the chaos card right now, which is pretty mint. Pretty freaking good. Enjoy your lurking. The dock is in. Lurker's number one. Yeah, he's had two profession-based subscribers in a row. Pawnbroker and a Wildland Firefighter. Both very honorable professions. Definitely want to use that, but we'll see. We'll see about that. <laughs> Paralysis? Where's the good pills, man? Dark Rock in the Beggar Room. All right, duly noted. Uh, we don't want to do this yet because we can't escape. I had a, I had a feeling. Oh boy, steam sale. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, we should be able to get everything here. Yeah. You can always make your own with a food dehydrator, said Victor. Be sure he's quite easy to make, actually. Tinted rock and greed room, top right. All right, then. Good eye, friends. You know what? I'm going to take I'm gonna take a peeksy. A little peeksy. Not ideal. Ah, worked out okay. Not bad. One of the only times I'll throw the knife diagonally is that room right there. One of the very few times. Most other times it's just not worth it in my opinion. Well... Oh, get stepped on, son. Get, get stumped. No, I have not been eating spaghetti, Isaac says. No. Uh, to throw diagonally, just hold diagonal and then let go. Well, you have to be moving, moving diagonally as well. It's actually quite tricky. You got to be moving diagonally and uh, holding diagonally and let go at the same time. That's actually kind of a pain to do. I don't know. Probably why I don't do it very often. Definitely not a requirement to play with a knife to throw diagonally. Just, uh... You hold two directions at once and release them simultaneously is correct. I find it very much helps if I'm moving the direction. Yeah. Leech is actually pretty OP in this situation. All right, well, it looks like we're gonna go, um, uh, we have 18 bombs, so there's no reason not to look for my secret room. It could be here. Can it be? No, it cannot be there. How about up top? Could not be up top either. Can it be here? Probably. With the analogs, yeah, that makes sense. It'd be easier. Check here, because it could be. 
It is. Cool, I can check out my uh, combat room now. Ooh. Money! Do do do. Tinted rocks south of the two by two. Yeah, we do have smaller and excess health, so I'm actually gonna pass on both. Well, I have bombs though. We'll, we'll we'll go back and get it. We got dark rock in here. It could be a gold chest with crooked's head for all we know, and I have no damage multiplier, so probably worth the worth the two bombs. So I'm not using anyways. Oh yeah, I can't I can't really get that. Not accessible at this time. Hey, okay. Well, I kinda do want that key though. Yeah, whatever. That's cool. Baroxy Sme Triple Six, little hand to you, friend. Welcome to the Dapper. Thank you so much for the support. Greatly appreciate it. Much love to you. Thank you for choosing to subscribe and support the content. I think you're amazing. Because you are. Get some hands up in the air for Paroxy Sme. Appreciate you. <laughs> 